Medtronic developed its Hugo robot specifically to challenge the Da Vinci system's long-running dominance in robotic surgery. The global medical technology giant, known for its life-saving devices like pacemakers, insulin pumps, and surgical tools, started developing the Hugo Robotic Assisted Surgery System around 2015. Medtronic, which is headquartered in Dublin and Minneapolis, describes Hugo as a next-generation modular platform to expand access to minimally invasive procedures. Its focus is urology, which is one of the most important and common specialties for the Da Vinci surgical system. The demand for robotics in the field is expected to increase substantially as annual prostate cancer cases are projected to double, rising from 1.4 million in 2020 to nearly 3 million by 2040. Silicon Valley-based Intuitive started developing the Da Vinci system in the mid-90s when the oldest baby boomers started turning 50, an age when the risk for prostate cancer rises sharply. Urologists adopted the system because it was less invasive than the status quo, which involved making a large cut in the lower belly. Today, more than 80% of prostatectomies in the U.S. are done with a robot, mostly with Da Vinci systems. The Medtronic Hugo system works like Da Vinci, but with some differences the company says make it more flexible and user-friendly. Instead of one big machine, Hugo consists of four separate robotic arms that can be moved around the operating room to fit each surgery. It's operated from an open console, so surgeons can sit up and still see and talk to the rest of the team. Hugo features Medtronic's AI-powered touch surgery video management and analytics platform. While Hugo is considered the first truly credible large-scale competitor to Da Vinci, smaller systems have gained traction. UK-based CMR Surgical's Versius has been used in more than 30,000 surgical procedures in over 30 countries, which makes it the second most popular soft tissue surgical robot worldwide. The company recently raised more than $200 million to accelerate growth, while the robotic system secured FDA approval to assist in gallbladder removal procedures. Several Chinese firms are also developing surgical robots that are emerging as credible alternatives to the Da Vinci system. Systems by Suzhou-based Kangduo Surgical Robot, for example, have been used for complex surgeries including prostate, kidney, and bladder removals. While smaller systems can flourish, Hugo is the first competing system from a major medical company with vast distribution networks. Medtronic just submitted the Hugo system for FDA approval in the U.S. after completing its expanded clinical trial. A decision by the FDA is expected in the second half of 2025.